Hey, what's up guys? I'm Ronaldo Ali and today we'll be checking on what's on my iPhone 6. So let's get straight into this video. So let's start at the dock, which is basically, yeah. I only have one page on my phone, as you can see. So on my dock, I have my music app, basically my life. Listen to music pretty much throughout the whole day. Then I have Tumblr, which is probably my one of my most favorite apps on my phone. I really love Tumblr, but I personally like it on the desktop more than on the phone. But Nevertheless, it's still one of my favorite applications on my phone. Then I have Snapchat. I think everyone knows what Snapchat is. Then I have the normal phone application. Then to get on my only phone page, which I have very simple. I try to keep my phone very organized and very simple. So I have messages, FaceTime, Skype, and Instagram. Use iMessage a lot and FaceTime. Skype, actually never used, never used it on my phone as yet. Then Instagram, everyone knows what's Instagram. Then I have Amazon, Google Calendar, which is my calendar of choice. Then I have App Store, Safari. I do use Chrome once in a while, like I interchange between two of them. It depends on the computer, like the desktop I'm using at the time. If I'm using a Mac, I'll use Safari. If I'm not using a Mac, I'll use Google Chrome. Then I have my photography folder, which is probably one of my favorite folders on my phone, besides my games folder, which I do use frequently. Afterlight, awesome editing application, photos, camera. Camera Plus, my preferred camera application of choice. I think I have any numbers in front of me, if I open this. Yes, I do. Best application ever. Like, I can basically control everything, the ISO, the aperture. Okay, not the aperture, the ISO and the shutter speed, which is really awesome. And I have manual focus and everything. Awesome application. I just messed up the whole photo. Anyways, Google Photos, which I use to back up all my photos from my normal photos because it's ultimate photo storage. Then Blue is how I got my wallpaper. It's basically a really awesome app. You basically blur, blur your background. Well, blur the image to how much you want, how intensive, and that's how you get your wallpaper, which is really cool. I really like it. And yeah, it's a really simple and nice app. Then I have layout, Instagram layout, Flippergram. Insta size and watermark to put my little logo when I take some photos. Then my favorite, definitely my favorite folder in my whole phone, games. I play a lot of games on my phone, like a lot. And this is only some of them because I recently restored my phone. So I have Geometry Dash, Geometry Dash, Meltdown, Doodle Jump, Minecraft, Ski Safari, Temple Run 2, Jetpack, Cross Your Road, Subway Surfers, Stack, Arrow, Piano Tiles, Zigzag, Color, Hopeless 2, Traffic Rider, Traffic Racer, Card of Mini Zombies, Triple Jump, Trampoline, Drop Hole, Slither.io, Trial Fortune, Rayman Adventures. I actually didn't play that since I um, saw this one yet. Cut the Rope, Angry Birds, and Mr. Jump. I still need to download like Real Racing and some more intensive games like Mortal Kombat 5 and stuff. That shall come soon. Then I have a utilities folder, which is just Speed Test, my router, whatever. Shazam to figure out what music. Is playing in the background, say if I'm out or something and I do not remember the name, I use Shazam to figure out what the song is. Then I have Steam, My Duty Cell, which is my carrier in my country, then I have Waze, Swift Key, which is my keyboard choice, which I really, really like, and I have different keyboard styles and stuff, whatever. Then I have um, Zip Extractor when I have Zips on my phone, Codefire, Fox, and that follow Instagram crap, which I honestly never used in a long time. Then I have Apple. Which is just basically Apple crap. So basically, yeah. All the Apple crap is decided. Then I have YouTube, Netflix, Twitch, TikTok to buy movie tickets. I think everybody knows about TikTok. I really want to see Angry Birds on my. Then I have Studio to check my YouTube, you know, whatever. Then I have Flipboard, awesome news application, mail, and settings. This is my very quick what's on my iPhone video. There's nothing much, don't really have much stuff in it. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Please like the quick video if you like it. Please dislike if you didn't. I'll see you guys in the next one. Please subscribe if you want to see more content from me. Bye, guys.